is going down. Construction workers work in the graveyard shift at a warehouse when something very strange is caught on camera. Oh, damn. This footage was posted by XAlien97, who works security at a construction site where the following Scary? chilling incident had taken place. XAlien says that ever since showing this video to the people who work there, employees have been on edge. They oh, fear damn. that they too will experience this terrifying encounter. In a very short video, XAlien recounts the events of that night. Oh, so I work security at this construction site, right? Yeah, right, right, <clears throat> right, right, right. <clears throat> yeah, all the trucks. We got these oh, real things right here. There. Yeah, 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 One yeah. One of these. These things are heavy. So you're saying this started Just moving? Just a little backstory. It was a construction worker that he needed help pushing one of these. He says a guy came up to him, another worker, and he says, I got you. Just guide me and I'll I push it you. for you. <clears throat> so I said, okay, cool. So he was guiding him. He kept telling him, back it up, back it up, back it up. And he was pushing it. When he was, when they were done, he went around the reel to tell him thank you. And uh, he says that uh, he was Just gone. Now the scariest part about this story is that when the worker had one day gone up to the main office of the building, he noticed a particular memorial photo of the workers oh, who used to work at the company. In this photo, he saw the- Oh shit! Oh, shit. Yo, I was predicting this too, like in my mind. So the, the guy that he saw was the guy on the tombstone or the, the guy that passed away in, on memorial, damn. Man who had helped him push the reel. Oh, Eerily, snap. the photo says he had passed away in 2015. The following is the video of what's believed to be the ghost of the ex-employee caught on camera. Oh, damn. Ow! Okay, bro, I'm about to go in gang gang style. I'm just gonna fire one round. It works, it works. So he's got the torch light or headlight, I should say. It was rolling automatic. Oh, what? Okay, so it seems like the guy was seeing someone, but on camera you do not see anyone. Okay, damn, son. And he's probably gonna realize there was no one, right? I wonder if he's gonna run away or not. So, you're saying that the guy he saw, I mean the ghost he saw was pushing this thing that's this heavy? That's wild, man. Like, you gotta eat a lot of chickens to get that Eerily protein, enough, you know what I mean? The person who was helping the worker with the reel suddenly disappears. According to the worker, he had walked around to thank the man for helping him, but to his shock, he was no longer there. Oh. It's as though he seemingly vanished into thin air. Given the story provided by the security guard, could it be that this worker had encountered the spirit of a deceased ex-employee? Or might there be some logical explanation for this truly odd occurrence? As with most videos, this one has yet to be solved. Uh, honestly, the way he was standing there after the fact with his hands down, it really felt like that. Yeah, he realizes that there was no one after that. But number five? Ow, ow, ow. Yeah, I love these videos, now, the man. the following video doesn't have much info, as the original source is unknown. But even without knowing its origin, the footage is no less scary. The story goes that a man who lives in a village near the Swiss Alps heard strange oh, noises snap. coming from the mountainous region. He decides to climb the mountain and find the source of these unusual sounds. When he gets to the top, he's immensely frightened by what he sees. This is the video he took. Oh snap! Oh snap! I can't believe this. I don't know if you saw it. Maybe because I'm alone, it seemed to me like. I don't know if you have seen it. Please take a look, he says. You can't see anything? I think we're gonna... Is this the bozo he's talking about? Like a, that looks like a statue. B or tree. I don't know what am I looking at. I still cannot see anything. Bruh, 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 bruh. Okay, so what's... What? So it's, it seems like... Smoke. Oh, they got arms? Oh, snap. They got arms and... But they're not really moving, or are they? It's so dark that it's hard to say. 
It looks like that they're making those Fortnite dance moves. Looks like that they're making those Fortnite dance moves. Yeah, okay. If I saw that, I would be freaked out too, especially if you're on top of the mountain, it's cold, it's winter, right? And it seemed to me that it moved. So with his own eyes, I don't think he's seeing much, but on camera, he's the up the brightness by the looks. The man sees what appears to be two giant figures standing in the distance. Even more chilling is the fact that the figures seem to be moving ever so slightly, confirming that they weren't statues, but instead something else entirely. The man believes that these might have been angels or an entity of some sort, as he felt a sense of peace and believed that the figures meant no harm. Yet when looking at the video through an infrared lens, the figures don't appear to be- I mean, just looking them do those Fortnite dance moves, that's harmful, I gotta say. Or CGI'd. Whatever had been on top of this mountain seems to have actually been there. But, like oh Thank you, come again! Always, you be the judge on whether or not something supernatural was captured. Just what exactly had been on top of this mountain? It's not, honestly, just looking at it, it's not scary, but what's scary is if you were seeing that with your own eyes alone that night, it would be pretty damn scary for sure. Not scary on video though. Okay, number four, let's get into it. On but December guys, 31st of 2022, three oh, yeah. policemen were dispatched to a house after receiving a call from a neighbor who Yo, we just saw this, we just saw this. reported that loud, strange noises were coming from inside. The neighbor stated that they heard deep, guttural noises and piercing screeches that were unlike anything they'd ever heard. When the police arrived, they were deeply disturbed by what they found. Now the yeah. video itself was taken by a paramedic who was immediately called to the scene. As it turns out, the police requested immediate medical care as they were unprepared to deal with the situation at hand. Man. They had no idea that the house they were in once belonged to a family of cannibals. Okay, uh, those of you that seen my last video, you probably seen this. Uh, I've seen it too, and this is like very freaky though. This is crazy. I think he's gonna bring a new perspective and probably new footage. So let's see. Bulls who enjoyed butchering human flesh and making exotic dishes that Damn. consisted of human remains. This Man. cannibalistic family has since passed away, but their house still remains in its shabby condition in a small town located in Greater Poland. Poland. On the night of New Year's Eve in 20... Okay. I'm never gonna go that greater area of Poland or whatever area that is in Poland, okay? No disrespect to the Poland homies. I like, let me come here, okay? Come here, okay? I love the Poland homies, but uh, not gonna go that area that he mentioned. 22. A 20 year old woman named Kamilka had been inside the house with a couple of friends. They were all playing with a Ouija board with the intent of conjuring the spirits of the cannibalistic family and the victims they consumed. This was a bad idea, yeah. as all of a sudden, Kamilka began acting erratically and extremely feral before barricading herself inside a room. Something had gone terribly wrong, according to her friends. I mean, that's not normal, so I'm not surprised if she would go cuckoo or crazy after. That's Kamilka not normal. had seemingly become possessed. When the police came, they were left highly unnerved by what they saw. This is what was caught. Damn, son. Yeah, they need to increase the police. <laughs> oh, damn. And the, 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 the cops didn't even have weapons, by the looks. They only had... Uh, <laughs> Paramedic Jesus, is that her? Growling man says, yes, that's her. The guy, I believe, had a taser. Bloody hell. What's going on here? Man number two. So we got subtitles this time. Last time we did it, I think. Can you hear that whisper? <laughs> okay, I'll play the, the clip, but screw this, I only get paid F in 5,000 PLN, which is approximately like 1,200 or 1,500, give or take, uh, you know, I mean, uh, if you're in the US, so that's not a whole lot, and I get it, I mean, in the US, like, the cops would be going, uh, getting their weapons drawing, they would have, like, they would have shotguns out, they would call in the FBS suit up, and here the homies don't even have clothes on properly, right? Yeah. They don't even have weapons on, they're out there like bare knuckles, like with those chicken arms and twig arms uh, hanging around. I don't blame these homies out here, bro, like, life is life, man, life's precious, bro. It's Sunday. <laughs> Five times the speed. So the paramedics was right on the spot. Damn. Yeah, 
Yeah, what would you do? She's upstairs above us, something upstairs. Damien, if we snap, if we swap over positions, maybe move out of the way and be careful. She has a wire of some sort, what paramedic said. Is she a bot? Please get out, sir, and we need to take some cover. Terrified okay. by Kamilka's strange behavior, the police are unable to go inside and save her. So, as a final attempt to get her out, they head outside and place a ladder against the side of the room where she hides. Oh, damn. This, however, did not go as expected. Okay, so here I was thinking, because last time when we saw this video, I thought this was the first clip, but it seems like that was the first clip and this is after. Okay, now it makes sense! Okay, yeah, we're getting different perspectives. So they have ladders here. This is a top room because before I was looking at this, it wasn't even making sense. Okay, this is a better video for sure. Better perspective. So it looks like she's inside playing around with the chair. There you are, you savage. Come here, flower. Why would you don't effing growl like a pig in bread? Oh, shiza, bro. Like, Guys, if you were a cop in Poland looking for this suspect, would you go without weapons? What would you do if you heard those screaming? Come here. Don't crawl. The officer's kind of chill right now. Oh, uh, eh, yeah, strobe lightning, boys. So it looks like okay so now i'm getting a better perspective it looks like the cops were shining light at her and the second they started doing that she started getting very aggressive at least in screaming come down your child is asking for you she got a child bro that's that's insane man. That is insane to me, guys. Like The police tell Kamilka that her daughter Victoria is with them as an attempt to lure her out of the room. That's her face, But this bro. didn't seem to work, given that she still stayed inside. Unfortunately, not much else is caught on camera as the video ends abruptly. But according to the paramedic who shot the video, Kamilka was eventually taken to the hospital. Strangely enough, it was upon arriving at the hospital that she started acting normal again. After being thoroughly examined by a psychiatrist, Kamilka showed no signs of any psychiatric disorders. She was her like blood was also thing. checked for any intoxicating substances that could explain her strange behavior, but no traces of any drugs were found in her system. To this day, Kamilka's family nor her friends could explain what happened inside that house. All that is known is that her family wishes to never see their daughter ever like this again. Whether Kamilka was possessed or if she had a temporary psychosis remains a mystery. Man, the, you see that? Bro, that's and that's insane. And people like that got children, man. That I feel in bad for In a previous for video, children, I talked about a family in India who's been documenting unusual events inside their Yeah, guys, we've seen this too. So, okay, I'm gonna skip this. I'm gonna skip this. We've seen it. We've seen it. This was a crazy video, but I will link you that. I will link you that. We've already seen it. I will link you that at the end, okay? So, number two, let's jump on to number two. This mechanic is the only employee at this workshop and it was just recently that he received a car from a customer who needed repairs on the vehicle. Ever since receiving this car though, strange things have been happening around the place. Like Both what? the business owner and the mechanic believe that there's something quite mysterious about this car. They don't know what it is, but they have a slight suspicion that it might be the reason as to why unexplainable things have been happening recently. Mm. This vehicle, according to them, scares them. Although feeling creeped out by the car's presence, they don't think much of it and carry on with their daily assignments. But then one day, a very peculiar incident is caught on camera. Marcos, the business owner, is watching over the shop through a security camera when he notices the mechanic acting very strange. The old man was moving in such a way that it made him feel very unsettled. But when the mechanic was asked as to what he was doing, he replied that he was talking to the client who had dropped off the creepy car. Marcos, though, found this very unusual the video Marcos had seen tells a different story. Oh, damn. This is what he saw. Ow, ow. And guys, the video that I skipped, I will link you that at the end. No worries, okay? This man has lost his mind. I'm checking the auto shot camera. I'm doing it on my phone. I'm in my house. So this is real time. 
And this man is talking to himself, damn. I don't understand. He's likely seeing that. I, I don't understand what's going on. He cuckoo, he crazy, or is seeing something? Yeah, he's making those hand movements. He's talking to himself. I'll ask through the camera what he's doing. Okay, let's ask him, he says. Hey, can you get me my phone? So it looks like that he's trying to hug whoever he's seeing. Who is he talking to? Hello? Oye, disculpa. Pero con quién, con quién está hablando? Who are you talking to? I'm talking to Mr. Carlos. I'm sending him the budget and explaining him. The accident uh, last night on the highway? So I was providing the budget, your door stop. Don't tell me that that person, Carlos, actually passed away on the, the highway last night. And damn. So I was providing budget. What I'm saying is. Relax. Which Oye, Mr. Carlos, but hey, un listen poquito. to me. Tú me, estás hablando, tú me estás Are you talking about last night's accident? Of course. Damn, 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 damn. Juan, you're messing with me. I'm just here talking to Mr. Carlos. I'm explaining him how can you come up. Hey, can you come up? You know what? You're not talking to anybody, man. But Mr. Carlos is right in front of me. You're not speaking to anybody, Juan. And yesterday, everyone died in that crash. What are you talking about? Juan, there's no one there. Damn, I think he's gonna realize. Uh oh, okay, we're gonna go full volume here. I'm trying to just read in. Come up and see. I recorded everything. I can't just do that. Man, come up. You're not alone there, bruh. I'll put the loudspeaker so he can hear you. Man, I recorded everything. Just come up there, bro. He's telling you, man. Come in, please, come in. Okay, I'll come in. Can you wait for me, please? Confused and slightly unsettled by the old man's behavior, Marcos immediately calls him to ask what exactly is happening. Okay. To a shock, the mechanic replies that Carlos, the client who had dropped off the car days ago, was visiting him to discuss details about his car and a racing accident that occurred the night before. Marcos was chilled to his core. Hearing him mention the racing accident from last night was beyond strange. Snap. As it turns out, Carlos, the client, had passed away in a terrible street racing accident Damn. the night before. The mechanic had not been aware of- Guys, do not do Fast and Furious 11 on the streets like that, okay? Vin Diesel, his family never dies, okay? That's in the movies, guys. Do not do that in real life. This man. incident until recently. The question is though, how exactly did he come to learn about this news? Could it be that the alleged spirit of Carlos had paid the mechanic a visit? Is the so-called haunted car responsible for this? Or is this simply a case of someone who's become slightly unhinged from doing too much work at the shop? Just like Marcos, viewers believe that something supernatural was caught on camera. Mm. I want to see his reaction to watching the video. Damn, man. Yeah, guys, want to like the video, subscribe if you wanted to see that reaction. Man, that is... Michelle A. and her small family live in a suburban home in Long Island, New York. Both she and her husband are happily raising four children while simultaneously running a traveling petting zoo. Although living a busy lifestyle, Michelle and her husband always make sure to prioritize the needs of their children. Given how much they care for their safety, they install a nanny cam inside their baby daughter's bedroom. Oh, damn. One night, while looking over at the baby monitor, oh, no, something no, no. downright spooky is caught on camera. Michelle says that her baby daughter typically sleeps through the night, and if she were to wake up, she would usually cry out for her mother. But on this night, something oh, unexpected happens. Watch. I think we're gonna see someone just watching the baby, bro, like, uh, out of nowhere. Yeah, 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 okay, I'm gonna make sure I aim. Yeah, we got a baby, so gotta... I gotta make sure my aim is correct. She woke up and pointing and laughing at something. Please don't tell me. So does this... So she does this for over an hour. For over an hour. One hour. As though she was looking and talking to someone. Okay, I'm gonna not keep the finger on the trigger. I don't want to fire that trigger. 
Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Michelle says Nothing. that her daughter appears to be pointing at something in the dark. What's even more odd is that her baby daughter was laughing and pointing at something for about an hour or so before going back to sleep. It's because of this clip. Man, those baby fingers are crazy small, man. I remember first time seeing a baby. I was like 10 years old and I saw like my friend's mom having like a kid and holding her. The, the fingers were so small. I was just mind blown, man. I was just mind blown, man. The life creation, the creation, the world around us is a crazy place, man. But it's mind blowing. Sometimes like existential hours, I guess, guys. Uh, do you go through that? Let me know. Just when you start thinking about everything around you and you're just questioning reality, you're looking at looking in the mirror, you see yourself and you're like, oh, Shiza, I'm really in this biage. You know what I mean? That's one of those quotes. I, I do that all the time. Like I question like, hey, man, why am I here, man? Like, obviously, I'm talking to camera. Some of you are watching, right? So it's like we're connecting. We're talking, right? Right now, I'm talking alone, but I know you would be, would, would be watching. So it's like just crazy, man. The Internet's crazy. That's like another reality on on its own in a way, right? Bruh. That Michelle thinks that her daughter has encountered something paranormal. According to her, her daughter was seeing something that we couldn't. Whatever it was that her daughter was seeing, Michelle hopes that it was nothing serious or anything same, that should same. be a cause for concern. Who knows as to whether or not her daughter had actually seen something that night. But like always, let me know what you think. Guys, guys, the video that we skip over is one of the best video. I didn't want to rewatch because I already did it. Click on this video on the screen. That's that exact video, man. You got to check it out to believe. Or click the video on the left if you've already seen it. Check these both videos out, guys. They don't want you seeing that. And I will see you right